Okay, I'm here with Jerry Ellsworth at the Maker Fair 2012, and take a look at this. She has fashioned a Commodore 64 to a guitar. So tell us, what is it all about? Is this the real thing or what? So I'm using the real Commodore 64 sound chip in this. The rest of the C64 is gone. At 6502, I removed that. And I'm using an FPGA to do a frequency uh, count on each string. So then I can process that and use the oscillators in the original sound chip to make that 8-bit sound. It's also a keytar, so you can press keys to make sounds. And the strings go through. They go through the original Commodore sound chip. So I can modify the, the qualities of the the strings by uh, changing their wave shape. So, for instance, I can make a white noise. So it's all processed with an FPGA and an analog front end that's doing some bandpass filtering, some piezo pickups, keyboards all scanned by the FPGA, and then the sound chip resides right there and it's getting uh, all the transactions from the FPGA. Mm -hmm. Okay, but you're also one of the featured makers on the web page. So what oh, was I that see. like? Was that like really exciting and people coming to get your autographs? Oh, you know, I didn't even know I was on the website, but yeah, <laughs> yeah it's exciting. I've, I've been doing a lot of projects. I have a YouTube channel with probably 200 projects on it. And it's really neat wandering around Maker Fair and having so many people recognize me and uh, talk about their projects and my projects. And so, what's your YouTube for us? So it's Jerry Ellsworth. So that's spelled J E R I and then Ellsworth, E L L S W O R T H. You can follow me on Twitter and YouTube and Facebook and keep up with all my uh, latest hacks and uh, projects. Okay, so tell me, how many all nighters did you have to spend? putting this thing together? So on this guy, um, mechanically it went together in about an, an hour. So I took a guitar and I cut the sides off of it and I slipped it inside the case. So it was very little work that way. And, and then early in the project, a couple weeks ago, I did a pickup of the piezo transducers. And I did an initial experiment and I thought that it was really uh, going to be fairly simple to do the project. So this week when I tried to wrap the whole project up, I found out that I was picking up overtones on the strings and it was making it sound really bad. So the last night before I came here, Thursday, I stayed up until 3 in the morning trying to tune it to make it sound better. <laughs> okay, so the Commodore 64, well that was made decades before you were born. I Why wish. this? I'm actually older than you probably think. I, this was my first computer. I was probably only 4 feet tall, but... Um, yeah, my first computer was a C64, uh, programmed on basic, you know, a lot of print statements and go-tos, and yeah, so I, I really have a fond uh, warm spot for the C64. Mm -hmm. Okay, so why don't we just close this out here with Jerry Ellsworth at the Maker Fair 2012. So let's close it out with a brief song on your thing, okay? Let's see, do you want Big Bottom or do you want uh, Sunshine of Your Love? I'm just learning bass, so. Well. Whatever you, that, that would fit the occasion. How's that? All right, let's see here. Okay, thank you. Thanks.